Hi guys and welcome to today's video. Uh, today I'm going to be doing a lab run and I'm going to be showing you Jahad in his full potential. Um, so a lot of people have been asking me to show Jahad off and I haven't yet because, well I haven't, but here we are. So you will be able to see him in this, this video, so eventually. The wait is over. Um, here are his stats, I'll show you his relics, his, his relics he's running. Um, yeah, he's got life still set to keep him alive and he's got a destruction set to give him more damage. Okay, so I'm going to quickly show you the other relics I'm using for the other characters and uh, go from there. So bam, um, he, I reset him today, I've not used him yet in lab, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, he's got a free free attack attack set with a lime relic, uh, that's to keep him alive. Not sure how good that'll be, but it's the best gear I've got, so we'll see. Uh, Mira, she's just got attack and destruction with the double dragon and the dawn retaliation relic. Um, yep, so that's what she's got. Machene's got the Lime Relic as well, she's got super high attack, which you can see she's got 50k, which is amazing. And it's super high level Lime Relic, so she should stay alive using that. And the nice Goblin Relic. Actually, do we have the... No, we haven't got level 2 one of those. So that's what we'll use here. Um, next, we've got Kun. Um, my Kun really needs some more attack, but he doesn't have it, so we work with what we have. Um, so yeah, I've got a Life Steal set on him, a Destruction set. And Relic-wise, we've got the Slap and the... It's Path of the Sword. I'm probably do with that, but he doesn't have it, so he, he can keep it. Okay, so Yuri, um, health and defense. I just want to keep her alive. She's a bit, she's not as strong as the like. So yeah, she is. Uh, she could do with some work. But yeah, that's the team we'll be running today. So let's go ahead and uh, and give this team a go. I'm quite excited actually, because uh, I've not used him yet, and I'm thinking he will really show uh, Jahad off. So. Guild-wise, uh, we are at the moment third. Yeah, elite. So we're in third. Um, as you can see, we're up to the hard level. So this is going to be a hard run, and I won't be taking a healer, so it's probably going to go wrong. <laughs> but let's uh, let's see how we can do. So I'm replacing God Killer Zero with Bam, by the way. So if you've seen any of my other videos, you'll see that you, I normally bring him because I like his confuse. And if I'm not bringing him, I like to bring White because White has a stun. And he gives counter attack to Mira and Jahad, but yeah, this is this is what we're running with. Uh, I think it'll work really well. So let's uh, let's give this a go. Yeah, I'm happy with that. This is going to be. I'm excited. I'm hoping Bam works out. I'm hoping he doesn't die. It is hard mode, so he could die. But okay, so here we go. So first turn, we need defense down. We'll move that out of the way. Still recording? Yeah, I'm recording. Um, yep, so attack up. And uh, start wailing with Jarhad. And I'm going to save Bams because his C3 increased everyone's attack. And I want Jarhad's attack to be buffed as soon as possible. Now, I would say uh, with Jarhad, you'll, you'll see his damage at the end and it's going to be quite high. It's going to be higher than Mirrors for sure. I wouldn't tell everyone to build him. I, if I'm new to the game and I don't have a lab team, you could consider building him, but he's very niche, he's only good for lab, so you know, it's, it's a big resource dump, um, and he only starts to shine at SSS, I mean, I, so, you know, it's a tricky one, but I like him a lot, so I'm, I've, I've built him. And you'll see that his damage will increase as the lab goes on, you'll see some crazy numbers from him soon. So, yeah. So you can see him using Kun at the end. That's simply because he will buff the highest character's attack, and that will be Jad, of course. Okay, let's see some big numbers game. Da, da, da. I think when you're making a lab team, and there's, there's so many ways you can build one. Um, people like to run dot teams. So, you know, it's dot, dot teams a high damage team. Other people like to run Mira uh, because Mira is fantastic. I think everyone should run Mira. If you can run Mira, she just makes everything so much easier because she she um, she just stays alive. <laughs> she no life to it. She just stays alive and. Get a bit of counter attack on her, she, she does such good damage. Um, now, Idol or Yuri, you need a defense break character. 
A defense break character will improve your team dramatically if you're not running one. I guess a lot of you guys watching this video are probably fully aware of that. So I've used Jarhad's C1 there uh, because his C1 gives him a crit rate boost. Okay, I might actually taunt here. Okay, and you'll see now Jarhad's damage is going to be way bigger this turn than it has been. It's going to be really big. See one as well. Get a bit worried about Mira, to be honest. She doesn't seem to be uh, tank that tanky this particular run. <coughs> and recovery on yeah, these mobs give recovery unavailable. 840k mob. It's not bad. I guess the good thing about this uh, setup is Jarhard's definitely going to survive being in the middle of that. Normally running at the front with his life still set, and that works really well for him, but that's how it's going to go. So I'm going to. This is not ideal. Hmm. See, normally with God Kill Zero, I have loads of mana. I have, I have so much mana. So much mana, but this particular team. Not so much mana. But sometimes, like, you just have to waste a turn almost like this turn to set up for the next one. For the next turn, I'm, set, I'm planning to do some C2s with Jarhad and C2s and uh, C1s with Mishene. And I'm going to use Kun's attack buff because I've got one more of his C2s to use. So I want to make sure I use that. But yeah, I'm just waffling on now, guys. Um, yeah, so as we get through these next two, next couple of turns, I want to give a shout out to Borg. Borkono Gaming. I can't say his channel in very well, but yeah. I don't know if you guys have seen his channel. It's a, it's a Hero Kantar channel. I love it. It's great. Plus, the only complaint I would have with his channel is that he made me wait so long for his his um, showcase for his SSS Morigen. He, he, I knew he had Morigen built. I, I spoke to him and, and I knew he had Morigen built and I'm like, I can't wait to see him in a video, and it took so long for him to make the video. He was making other, it was like, his patch notes, his this, his that, I'm like, get that, I'm, like, I'm thinking to myself, show us the Moira Jin. <laughs> come on, that's what the people want. Anyway, that's on his channel, so if you watch any of his videos, go and watch that, um, it's, it's fantastic. Anyway, um, this isn't going very well, guys. Well, we're in turn seven, you know, we're, we're alive, so there's that. But Bam's dead. Didn't I didn't see that coming. This new comp of mine. <sighs> Questionable. Although look at uh, just look at Micheni. That lime relic on Micheni is doing work. I should probably give her lime relic to Bam because it's a high level. Maybe that would keep him alive long enough. Or maybe this team's missing white. Well, I guess we'll have to survive without Bam. Shame really, because Bam could be doing some defense breaks as well. Yeah, this definitely isn't the best run, but hmm. I think we'll hit. Are we at 40 million? I'm hoping we hit 40 million. We could hit. We could. We could hit 40 million still. I'd be happy with 40 million. For a, for a first attempt with this comp, I, I would take 40 million. I don't know if you guys know this, but if you're running lab and you're not happy with your damage, you can just kill the game and you will get your run back. I do it all the time because I really like lab and, you know, like, I just like lab and I like getting high scores, so I do that all the time. So yeah, one, yeah, we're gonna hit 40 mil here. We're gonna hit 40 mil. Yeah, should do. Easy, easily. Got another C2 from Jarhad coming as well. 
I could have been a lot higher if uh, maybe I'd have to switch those line relics around. I don't really like giving uh, Mira blood, blood sucking because, well, I mean, she she doesn't need it in anything but this. I mean, I'm, on, I'm doing hard mode right now, so, you know, it's part of the reason why this is harder than it would normally be for me. And I'm recording a video, which is quite kind of distracting, if I'm honest. Uh, yeah. We are coming up to the end, you'll see some damage now. Here we are. 40. 45? No, 40. 44.2 mil. So, not a bad score, not the best. Yeah, there's the damage breakdown. Um, so, yeah, Machine is doing quite well there. Um, I think she's she's uh, she's coming from strength to strength. She used to be doing not very much. She's she's progressing nicely. I'm looking forward to her damage increasing. Macon really needs some work. Jahad, yeah, he's he's done okay. <laughs> he's done okay. Uh, Yuri, just useless character. She brings defense break, so we'll give her we'll give her that. Bam, kind of a disappointment if I'm honest, Bam. I guess maybe I guess I mean I've not geared you the best, but I don't have all the gear for you. I just don't have it. Um, yeah. That's that. I hope that video was helpful. Um, I will leave it there. But just like I said, just to reiterate what I was saying earlier, please go and check out Borkovno's channel. Check out his Morrigan video. It's really cool. You're gonna like it. His his content is way better than mine. His audio is better. The quality of his videos is better. You know, uh, yeah, go and check them out. Uh, and as always, you're welcome to join our Discord channel uh, for Elite. It's not just for this game, it's also for Seven of the Sins and Sino Alice. And we also have some other games on there, but they're the main ones we play. And there is a reading test. A lot of people are joining the Discord and they're not finding the channels for the games and they think it's dead quiet. It's not quiet, just you need to go to the Rolls and, Rolls and React uh, like sub channel and react to the game you want to play with us and you will be able to join us in the discussions and the banter okay uh yeah have a good day all i hope that was interesting okay, so i wasn't 100 percent happy with that last run so i figured i'd just do one more so i'll show you the end of this one so what i changed just for, just for the interest is i gave bam the level 5 lime relic and he survived till turn 9 because he just died there so so it was much better for that and machine's got the other one i also gave machine the Path of the Sword from Kun, and Kun stayed alive until just now, so, you know, that it's, it's gone better. But I wanted to just uh, do another run to see if I could get, if I could beat my score, basically. Uh, yeah, and it's, it's gone. I have beat it. So I've just, all I've done is change those couple of relics around, and you can see, beat my score by a few million now. So it's like going to be 40, 48, 40, so 48 mil. So yeah, I've beaten my score by quite a few mil though. And all I did is change the line relics around and give uh, Machena the path of the sword. So yeah, that's just to uh, show you a slightly better run, because I wasn't 100% happy with the last one. Uh, yeah, so this is actually the end of the video. Go check out Borkona Gaming. Goodbye. Good luck.